Robert Wynn Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about room onion. Okay, well, what's an onion? Well, it's lots of layers, right? And that's what we have to realize with our rooms. Not only with our rooms, but the structure itself and everything that goes on inside of it. So rooms are multiple layers, but they're multiple layers of distortion. We have to kind of peel through those layers of distortion to get to the truth, if you will. What do we have? Dimensional pressure? Well, that's modes. We have certain distances in our room. We have width, length, and height, and certain energy fits in those distances, and certain energy doesn't, okay? And that's just all part of physics. Reflection, distortion, reverberation. Every surface in our room contributes about 17%. You know, you take 600, divide it by six surfaces, you're going to get about 17%, right? Yeah, are we? Pretty close. So the bottom line here is room dimensions, reflections, and then look, even inside the room, we have this break point, it's called the Schroeder frequency, where the pressure subsides that 100 to 200 hertz range, and then it turns into reflections. So there's break points within the room, more layers, more distortion, right? Okay, so then we have pressure level. How, do, how loud do we listen at? How much energy do we have in the room? Are we balancing the amount of energy with the usage and the volume of the room? That's critical. Setup, speak or boundary interference effect. Stay away from those boundaries. I see constant room forms with the speaker right next to the wall. Well, this is speaker boundary interference effect. You're too close to the boundary. You're going to create problems. Stay back four to five feet. Good start points. Speech intelligibility. How many words in a 10-word sentence can you clearly understand? Eight, nine, six. You have to define all that. Once again, more layers to the onion. Music intelligibility. Not an actual index. That's why it's in quotes. But does the room sound musical? Another layer of distortion, right? Noise. Even our barrier technologies in our rooms have layers. So. We have a sandwich, uh, and you can see here in this graphic the multiple layers that we use, and we put these sandwiches between the studs. It's part of our uh, design service for barrier noise technology. Okay, Layers are all frequency and amplitude dependent. More layers of the onion. See, everything in the room is all about layers, peeling back those layers. Layers of distortion, layers of the right frequency and amplitude density, to stop noise. Uh, let's see, walls. Treatment, noise BTU, we have three walls in our room, right? This is the treatment wall, this is the room, faces the room, and then here we could have a BTU wall, which is warm and cold, and here we could have the barrier, which is noise, right? So you could have three walls. Once again, more layers, more peeling back, more step-by-step -step approaches. Getting good sound in a room is all about doing a lot of things, but just as important doing them in the correct order. Because like steps, they just build upon each other. Okay, well, we're here. We want to go to here. So you're going to skip these two. You'll pay for it here. There's no easy ride here. Okay. I think of that bumper sticker <laughs> when I was a kid. <laughs> kid. It was gas cash or you fill in the blank. Nobody rides for free. Same thing in acoustics. Nobody rides for free. You get nothing for free. You get the strategy that you apply the correct tactics for. Room onion, multiple layers of distortion and everything else going on. So I really hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. And if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis, so that'll help you. Thank you.